The process industries are at an interesting juncture facing disruption by fast evolving technologies. When you rewind a decade back, technology and infrastructure maturity were not able to support the transformation journey. Critical issues such as technology convergences, halving technology refresh cycles, decline in the skilled workforce, sustained profitability needs, and thwarting competitive threats are driving the process industry customers to embrace digital transformation more than ever before. Digital transformation is really a journey as outlined in the model that we've shown here. The digital maturity of the organization is determined based on what stage the company is in. And there are three stages of maturity. Stage number one is digitization, which is the adoption of digital technologies to drive operational intelligence. Stage number two is digitalization, which is automation of the work process and smart integration with the work orders. And stage number three is digital transformation, which includes enterprise performance optimization, new customer interaction models, and alternate revenue monetization. Digital transformation is a defining path to excellence, enabling operational automation, performance excellence across the enterprise, innovation on business processes, creation of new business models, new sources of revenue, realization of smart manufacturing, enhanced decision-making process, and ultimately altering the culture of the organization. As we explored digital transformation, we found a number of pertinent use cases across the industries, and they have embarked on an ongoing journey to achieve predictable operations and sustainable profitability. The adoption intensity clearly varies by the industry and its subsegments. Frost Sullivan characterizes the industry adoption of digital technologies by three levels. Enterprise digitizers, where less than 5% of the customers are there. Then selective digitizers, where 55 to 60% of the customers are there. And then non-digitizers, where there is about 30 to 35% of the customers. So clearly, while digital transformation has great benefits, the foundation to a very successful transformation is data quality. Process industries have long captured data from sensors, but seldom use it comprehensively for actions. Frost & Sullivan finds that less than 5% of the data captured is utilized, and the industry is data rich, but insights poor. It's also very important to note that data quality depends on a multitude of factors, such as accuracy, timeliness, reliability, validity, integrity, and consistency. In Yokogawa's opinion, overcoming data quality issues will help the industry shorten the time cycle from data extraction to sustained value creation. Some of the other prominent challenges faced by process industries include lack of true visibility from an operations flow to the C-suite and communication divide on objectives between the management and plant operations, siloed decision making restraining enterprise performance optimization, lack of cross-organizational performance metric structure. To overcome these aforementioned challenges, the market is awash with solution providers large and small, promising siloed solutions to the process industry customers and aiding a very successful digital journey. But among all these solution providers, very few stand out like Yokogawa. And Yokogawa has established itself as one of the largest independent automation solution providers with rich experience across process industries. Its Transformation 2020 Midterm Business Plan is all about digital transformation built on the foundation of best-in-class automation and digitalization technologies. Its ability to converge the worlds of OT and IT on the foundations of business and domain knowledge is its single biggest differentiator from its peers. A very relevant use case is that of a US-based refinery, which worked with Yokogawa, digitized and improved the quality of data that was captured. Subsequently, it leveraged remote monitoring by consultants, for advice on countermeasures when the process parameters went out of normal parameter values. The refinery was thus able to achieve quicker time on resolutions, reduce performance variability, and an annual savings in the range of 13 to $65 million. Regardless of the maturity stage of a company, it is always important to work with an industry leader and a trusted partner who can co-create value and drive life cycle cost optimization and Yokogawa continues to drive excellence for the process industry.